Hello everybody, my name is Sonia and today I'm going to be making a video talking about my experience with Ben Foster in the Pharmacy Technician Professional um, Program. I'm first going to start saying that I'm making this video and it's my own opinion, it's my own experience and I'm making this video because I want to talk about um, you know my experience with the program, my experience with the Ben Foster staff and everything like that. Because when I went to start the program, um, there were not a lot of good reviews and there were no videos talking about the pharmacy technician program. So I decided to make this video in case somebody is thinking about um, signing up for the program or anything like that. So I'm making this video talking about my experience. But it's my own opinion. Nobody told me to do this video. Nobody is paying me to do this video. It's my own experience. So I'm going to talk about a little bit about the program um, and a little bit about the price and how the class works and everything like that. So Ben Foster has two pharmacy technician programs. The first one is the pharmacy technician professional and the second one is the pharmacy technicians and that's it. The difference between them, they are the same classes, the same tests, everything is the same. The only difference is the professional you had to complete an extension of over 160 hours, which was in the pharmacy technicians. You don't have to do um, anything. It's just the classes. You do your final, you do your lab videos, and then that's it. Um, you basically graduate. And when I started the program, I started in the pharmacy technician professional, and I started in August of 2019. So when I started, the pandemic um, was not here. So when the time came for me to do my extendership, well, I was homeschooling my kid and, you know, with all the pandemic, the daycare, their clothes. So I decided to change programs from the pharmacy technician professional to the pharmacy technician. And they said that it was not a problem because it's basically the same classes. So they just told me um, to make a new, I, like I make a new program and then um, they switch my classes they put all my classes to the new program and i didn't have to pay anything anything for the new program i didn't have to pay anything i was just my balance from my old program was switched to the new balance and then that's it all the classes were um were um transferred so yeah it was not a problem at all because they understand that the pandemic you know was hitting and everything like that so it took me 15 months to complete my program and the program is at your own pace. You have 18 months to complete the program. You can complete it in three months. You can complete it in nine months. You can complete it in 18 months. For me, it was 15 months. And, and for the prices of the program, they have three different prices because you, you have three options of payment. You can pay it full, which I think is like $100, something like that. You can pay it um, out of pace where they take out the money out of your bank account. And that one is $1,328, something like that. And then they have the monthly payment. What they call the monthly payment is when you sign a check and you send the payment to them through mail. That's the one that I got because when I started, the reviews were saying that they the people they put it out of pay and Penn Foster would take the whole amount at once. So I didn't want to have any problem with that. So what I did is I decided to make the monthly payment. It's more expensive, but I was making the payment myself. I was paying $49 a month and um, they will um, give you 10, like my payments were on the 16, but I had to onto the 26 before they charged me. I think it was $10 for late fee. But they are also very flexible with the payment. So let's say um, when the pandemic started that, any, that no one was working, I called them and I said, you know, my husband is not working. We cannot make payments. So they took two months and they switched to the end of my um, payment. So, yeah, so they didn't charge me any late fee and everything like that. Every time you have, um, you can make a payment, you call them and they will be there for you and they will give you an extension let's say you 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 can pay for that day but you can pay in 20 days so you say listen i can pay this day i did that also i i pay and i call them and say i can make a payment on the same thing but i can make a payment on the one of next month 
so they switched it over there so they didn't charge me late fee um and also the program the pharmacy technicians is accredited and i know that because i already received my diploma and i already applied for my florida pharmacy technician license and i have it you have to make sure that when you apply for this program what are the requirements for your state for florida you just have to complete an accredited program and apply for your license and then that's it they give you your license i pay 105 dollars for my license but depending on your state, some states, for example, in Texas, you have to take the PTCP exam for you to be a pharmacy technician. But in order for you to take the PTCP exam, you have to take an accredited program, which Penn Foster is. So make sure that before you sign for the program, you check your state requirements. Um, and also, um, the program will include in the price that I told you, um, the program, let's say you pay a full amount. So you pay $798, I think it is. You will get your books. They will do it online. Or if you want them shipped to you, they will ship them to you. You also will get a $450 kit for the last class before the final, which you have to make the videos, which you can see on my channel. And it will, they will also pay for your PTCB exam. And they will also pay, I think the PTCB exam is, I think it's $160 if I'm, or $129, something like that is the PTCB exam. They will pay for that. They will give you a voucher also for the $29 practice test in the PTCB exam website. So everything is included on that price. And after you pay them all, they will, they will ship to your house the diploma and the transcript the official transcript transcript they will send them to you okay now i'm going to talk about a little bit about the classes the classes um you can see in the website all the classes that you have to take for the classes um they will be um test right you have to do your reading then you have to do questions and the questions you will grade them yourself so you're going to put um I, I understand it's okay or not so good or not at all, something like that. And then you have your key points, which you can study for your test, and then you have your test. Your tests are 20 questions. All of them are 20 questions, but you don't have to write papers. You don't have homework, nothing like that. You just do your reading and your test for each lesson of the class. And then the last... Um, class is your final and that one is, that one is 90 questions because that's like an example of the ptcp exam because the ptcp exam is 90 questions multiple choices all the tests are multiple questions and also um before the final you have to make i think it's 15 videos with the with the lab kit that they will send you so in the lesson four, you will have your instructions. You have to print all the papers and you have to, um, they will send you like, they will, it's going to be like a table and we will tell you the step that you have to make. And then you have to make your, your video. You have to submit it to YouTube. You have to put the link for your YouTube video in a Microsoft Word document and then you have to submit that in the Dropbox um, portal of your um, student portal. You will submit that with the paper with the instructions. And then, so yeah, you have to put your um, student ID, your lab number, and they will give you a grade for each lab because remember, each lab is different. And um, yeah, basically then after that, you will take your final, which is 90 questions, and then after you make your whole payments, they will send you your your um, diploma or your transcript. Let's say you still have um, more payments to make and you wanna apply for your license, but you don't have your diploma yet. So what they gonna do, they will send you a letter saying that, oh, your name and she complete the program and um, now she's eligible for the for the for the um, pharmacy technician license they can also do that but when i'm when i 
finished my program, my balance was at zero. So after I graduated, I called them and I said, you know, I finished my program and they put the request to send me my um, diploma and my transcript. And now I'm gonna show you my um, diploma. So this is my diploma. And as you can see, it's just pharmacy technician, no pharmacy technician professional. So yeah, and it's Penn Foster and selling you everything in one sentence. I would say that my experience was good with the Penn Foster. If I have any questions, I called them and they were there to help me. Um, they were always so kind to me. They were always understand and you know, the program is at your own pace. So let's say you have a full-time job, you're a mom, it's gonna be um, possible to do it. I have three kids and for me, if I did it, I know you can also do it. If you have any questions, you can leave them on the comments down below and I will be happy to help you. Thank you for watching.